I am here today to announce the winner because the winner is a Bel Air Highlander. And I congratulate Sarah Murillo. Well, I honestly, I never thought that I would ever get this opportunity. I've been participating in the in the art like in art competitions for four years now, and I had never really come home with anything like substantial enough to be like, you know what, like I, I did that, and today I finally feel like I finally accomplished something. She and um, over a hundred young people, high school students from across El Paso, participated in an art competition that was sponsored by my office and um, the winner of that art competition would get the distinct honor of having his or her art hung in our nation's capital. So there's a tunnel underneath the capitol leading to the state capitol from the congressional office buildings. And as you're walking through that very long hallway, you'll see artwork hanging up to, to your right. And visitors that come from all over the world will stop and look at that artwork and Sarah's artwork from El Paso, Texas, Bel Air High School will be hanging there. It actually does need a little bit of highlights. A little bit, yeah. I like to draw or paint from the heart, uh, something that has meaning to me, and maybe we'll, like, I try to reach out to other people, you know, to get them to feel something with, with the things that I, I draw, and I chose to draw my, my grandma, because, um, I mean, she, she, I love my grandma, she means so much to me, and when I was younger, she would always babysit me, and, like, you know, she would, make me my favorite food or even like the abuelita chocolate like I would I would drink that a lot as, as a kid so I just figured I took I took a picture of her holding a little cup and um, I thought that it would be a good fit to try to put that into the, the little logo. I'm so proud I'm the, we are such a great community and we have the best people in the universe and so I'm always excited and happy and proud to be able to show off the greatness that is El Paso.